What's up, fuckers? It is Jizzy, and today we are playing with the Franken Skull fucking box mod. But you're wondering where that is. Let's go ahead and start off that bullshit, shall we? It's garbage. It's utter fucking garbage. Unless I fill this thing to the fucking brim, it doesn't work. You know, and I gotta squeeze the fucking dog shit out of it. There's like one flat end on this side that I can actually use. And it, it just, I gotta open this bitch up and then start squeezing it that way. Just to fucking, for this bitch to work. When I was using different batteries, but this one actually fires with it on. Hold up one second. Oh, now it's not. There you go. It wasn't firing with the other batteries for some fucking reason. I got this at a, a point two, I think. It does well, especially since this fucking hole is so damn tiny in the top, you know? But it does produce this. I didn't like that at all, too. Fucking bottom airflow on a fucking squonk, but it actually works. It catches, the cotton catches you just right, you're not gonna fucking spill out of the sides. So that works. But this doesn't work for shit. It sounds like it's doing something, but it's not. It gets to the top and it doesn't like squirt up, it just like barely dribbles. I'm squeezing my dog shit out of it. Try! Right. Told you. One second. There we go. It does nice. Alright, let's talk. What the fuck was that? See? Misfires with that stupid fucking bottle in there. Get out of that bottle, you fucking. Told you, this time it actually didn't make me look like a fucking asshole. Alright, let's see what's inside the fucking box, shall we? We have a bag of parts. You got your Allen wrench. You got two fucking coils that, even, that come out to about a, a 0.5. Four extra grub screws. And a whole shitload of fucking rubber things. I always forget the name of them. Then, you got your Franken skull right there. You got your fucking RDA. And this happy little piece is to replace that top so you can put whatever fucking top piece you want to put on it. The thing is, this bitch won't come off. I don't know if it's a screw on top or it's a fucking pull, but whatever the fuck it is, that motherfucker does not want to come off. Here's the gray version. So you guys can see it a little bit clearer. And there's the inside. All nice and clean. Done really well. It's a damn shame this thing is a piece of garbage on the fucking bottle, you know? That's really all I got about this bitch. I've had it for about, maybe, it's almost going to be two weeks. I've been playing with this thing. And so far, so bad, you know? Actually, no, a week. I've had it for about a week. Uh, batteries. I mean, I'm using the black ones. I'm using the ones from Pegasus. So it's lasting me about... Maybe two hours. Yellow M MXGLs last me about maybe two and a half hours, three. Depending how fucking low I build on this bitch, but that's to be expected. And really, that's it. I mean, it's, if you really want it, 18 fucking dollars or 14 dollars, I really can't remember, from uh, 3F Vape. Oh, let me go check. It's on their fucking front page. <sighs> Come on, bitch. There it is. 18.99. They got it in burgundy, gray, fucking green. They call it Tiffany blue. Bitch, it's green. And black. And that's really all I got to tell you, people. Nothing, because it fucking misfired. There we go, bitch. I'll let you guys know if the fucking gray one lasts longer in my next review. Hopefully that fucking device comes out some fucking time. It's that, uh, it's one, uh, it's like this bitch, but you can actually put the liquid in the fucking center right here, and it's got an RDDA top. I can't remember the fucking name. It's been so fucking long. I ordered that bitch in early fucking December, and it barely shipped like a week ago. 
That's all I got. Later.